they say hey I love you I love you for you I love your body the way it is and I say thank you and I wear them and you see them and you like them and if you don't that's not my problem <laughs> Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. If this is your first time with me, thanks for stopping by. If you are returning, thank you for coming back even though I haven't been back in a while. So I decided to hop back on because, you know, there's something about going to work, coming back home, going to work, going back home, doing nothing in between that's kind of depressing. So I decided that I would kind of hop back into my creative outlets and this is one of them. So uh, about maybe like a fourth of y'all and if you're any good at math, you'd see that. That's, That's not a not lot. lot. Um, requested that I do a video like this and today I am going to do a try on haul, I guess, of some pieces, pieces <laughs> that I thrifted at Buffalo Exchange. It was my first time going and I was very impressed with the options and um, just the establishment itself. My goal was to find some things for fall and I did. And so I'm gonna style some of the things that I got with things that I already have. Maybe give you guys some inspiration for when it actually starts getting cold here because you know, like today, today's what, the 25th of November and it was 70 degrees outside today so um as you might all know um fall in texas is very wishy-washy you know we can't decide what season we're in with that being said let me show you some of the pieces that i got okay first thing that i want to show y'all is this um trucker jacket um, it's from Original Deluxe. This is actually a men's jacket. And I thought, you know, that I love corduroy, first of all. If you can't tell, let me just get a little closer. It is corduroy. And I just love the inside. I want to be warm. Hello, that's the goal here. Fall, it's getting colder, allegedly. And so I've been starting to like that rugged kind of tomboy -y look a little bit i don't even know how to describe it so i love madewell um do i actually shop there not really because you know the clothes are a little pricey um and i just haven't really had any motivation or just you know a strong urge to go drop triple digits on one thing and that might not be a lot for some of y'all, but for me, I just, there's just some things I'm willing to spend a hundred plus on and it's just like not jeans. But, guess what I found? Wow, 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 wow. Madewell jeans. Madewell. Oh, take a look at that. And honey, I kept the tag because I couldn't, I actually couldn't believe the price that I got. Okay, this pair, this pair was brand new, okay? Brand spanking new, and look at that. Look, $128 flippin' dollars for this pair of jeans, okay? Um, and guess how much I got them for? Drum roll, please. 28 bucks, $100 off of a brand new pair of Madewell jeans at Buffalo Exchange. It doesn't get any better than that. <laughs> and I did get another pair of Madewell jeans um, at Buffalo Exchange. Or, well, they're not jeans, they're like more pants. But I decided, you know, I love browns and I love neutrals. And so I saw this and I was like, oh my gosh, I've been obsessed with wide leg pants lately. And I said, why not? And when I tried them on, they fit great. Another thing with pants, I'm tired of wearing belts and you know, the way that I'm built, some of you guys might be able to relate. Doing the whole, you know, gotta find pants to fit my thighs, my booty, and 
you know, the waist is, you can fit a child in there like a pouch. You know what I mean? It's like not flattering, it's not fun. We don't always wanna wear a belt. So, these jeans, they do it for me. And you'll see in just a second. That's <laughs> all I got surprisingly, but all good finds, all good buys. So let's see what I'm gonna wear with them. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's the transition music. If I'm being honest, these pants are just a bit hard to style because for one, I don't like to wear patterns, especially on my pants, because I hate drawing attention to my thighs, which is gonna happen regardless of whether there's patterns or not. But, um, yeah, I had worn these with a white turtleneck and I thought it looked bomb and then later on looking at pictures I was like actually this looks like trash so it's just I'm still trying to figure out how to wear these to be honest and I know that this top is quite summery but with how our weather is lately I mean it is appropriate so definitely can get away with you know wearing some summer deals but to make it feel more like fall, of course I wore the mules. My mules are not made well because those are probably like 300 bucks. I don't even know. But these are from Old Navy. Oh my gosh, I need to get myself a wedgie. <laughs> okay. This is probably the most fall outfit that you will see in this video. Um, I mean, the next one will be fall too. Don't like stop watching because I just said that. But <laughs> um, honestly, I was never a beanie girl. And I just think I've been influenced. Like, wearing a beanie just makes you look a little bit cooler and that's how I feel right now. This vibe is warm, it's cool. Did you see my boots? Blundstone, by the way. Yeah, super comfortable, super hip, sponsored. <laughs> um, but yeah, and my jeans, another pair of wide leg jeans. They're from, yeah. This jacket is so warm. I'm actually sweating right now. It might have something to do with the dance I just did, but this, this is the real deal here. So this brand that I told you about, looking for something warm, give it a look. Or just go to Buffalo Exchange. Ding! Not gonna lie, I'm a little bit out of breath <laughs> after, after doing all that, but like, that's how these jeans make me feel. Like these jeans, like let's just be, let's just say it how it is. Like these jeans make the booty look crazy. Like, how, how else am I supposed to, you know? They just hug me, they give me a big hug. They say, hey, I love you. I love you for you. I love your body the way it is. And I say thank you and I wear them. And you see them and you like them. And if you don't, that's not my problem. <laughs> I mean, just look. These are probably my favorite pair of jeans ever. And honestly, if it came down to it, I might, if, if I had no other choice, I'm, I probably would buy them full price and I'm not, that's, 
not ashamed to say that. I just love the turtleneck. I mean, it's so simple, but you know, you look like you're going somewhere. Like, especially with these Liz Claiborne boots. And then let's just say one fall day, it decides to get a little chilly because sometimes it does and you're going out. Like, let's say, you know, you're going to like a simple dinner, nothing too fancy, but you want to, uh. excuse me, you want to look, ew. You want to look, you know, you want to look kind of classy, right? And it's getting chilly, right? So let's just grab something off this clothes rack over here to the right. <laughs> okay. Okay, boom. Okay. Okay, boom. Am I wearing it correctly? Oh. Okay, now she's expensive. Like, now she's expensive, honey. She's expen- Do we need a montage? Do we- Like, are you tired of me? <laughs> she needs a walkthrough. Conclusion, go thrift shopping, buy jeans that give you a hug, okay? Buy jeans that give you a hug, don't settle. If the jeans don't fit the way you like them, don't just say, oh, well, I need jeans, I'm gonna buy them anyway. Don't do that, because I lived my whole life doing that, and you know what? I'm free now. And wide leg jeans, if you are extra large and in charge in the thigh, honey, if you want, that good thigh to waist ratio when it comes to your jeans. That's the way to go. I'm just saying. Thank you guys for watching. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. If you haven't watched my other videos, do it right now. You know, you've got some time. Go watch some videos, like them, share them, all that jazz. Also, follow me on Instagram. Twitter, even though I don't have anything really interesting to say on Twitter. SoundCloud, that's really important. I have songs on there. And um, hopefully I'll have another video for you guys in a week, okay? Goodbye.